Yo. <gasps> okay. Hey. Oh, there's two. There's three <gasps> of them. Okay. <laughs> gotta go. I got it. Okay, there's only one of them behind you. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. You can run, right? That's what I'm doing. <laughs> Shit, dude. That is a... Hello. To the tram. Hurry. Hello. Hurry to the tram. Help. They don't have tickets. <laughs> No, 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 no. Close. They Good don't door. know how to open Good door. doors. Good door. Okay. Ticket, ticket, <laughs> What ticket. if they came and waited in line? Yes. Ticket. Yes. yes. Okay. I'm safe. I'm safe. Now. God. Jesus Christ. That was intense. It's <laughs> crazy. What was up with that, like... Like sound echo. Uh, it was a siren. <laughs> oh my god. There's Out of the frying pan. Thing. Without our frying pan. Yeah, but I have a rake now, so screw that thing. So there are bosses in Silent Hill games, so it's basically Resident Evil, Survivor Horror. Survivor Horror. Uh, uh, no. But like, Resident Evil's way better. Except for six. Yeah. I still want to play through every Resident Evil on the channel. The Silent Hill is just like more of a horror game than a survival horror, but there are like boss fights like you said, right? I or is mean, it just like or was just Pyramid Head somewhat of one? It's well I don't know if they're like specifically bosses but they're definitely bigger enemies and stuff like things that you'll probably just have to run away from and you can't really do anything about like pyramid head you could not kill him there's no way you could do anything about him yeah. ever he is right. one of the coolest hey. bad guys, though, ever. He's pretty cool. Why is that hit? Why does he have a pyramid head? That question He's will just be freaking pyramid head, dude. Oh, wait. Am I over here? No, it oh. should have your location. Maybe next page? Or maybe you have to find the map to this area. Well, probably. Okay. I just hope on. there's none of these through the door. Okay, downstairs nope. we go. <laughs> or not? Nope. Man. But that says X. I'm confused. Okay. Well, that makes it better. <laughs> We're fucked. Thanks. Straight fucked. Oh, oh boy. Yeah. Oh boy. You know, okay, here's something that's bugged me most of my life. Oh, yeah? Fucking, like, direct TV and charter and shit like that. Okay. Why does a cable commercial or internet commercial have to, like, try to tug at your heart? Okay, it's like, John, he stuck with charter for most of his life. Then he ended up with cancer. If he got direct TV, internet, and cable... He would have never have gotten cancer. Like, you know what I mean? Dude. Have you ever seen that, like, freaking end of the world Geico commercial? It was, like, uh, these, like, high official, like, government people and the president and stuff in, a, like, a war room or something. And they were, like... There's only one more minute until a meteor strikes the earth and uh, <laughs> I know what you're talking extinguishes about. all life on earth. And then the president just came up like, wait a minute. If you switch to Geico, you can save 25% on car insurance. And then everybody was like, we're saved, and just everybody's clapping. 
<laughs> just so happy. Yeah, I know Everything exactly what you're talking it. about. Oh, yeah, water. Running water. But I know what you're talking about. It was great. I love dumb commercials like that. If you've seen the fucking... What was that commercial? It was it was a Japanese commercial, though. It was like a lady and this guy or whatever, and they were on a date. And then a dog attacks this lady in the corner. Or like it's, or not attacks, but they had like this dog's holding back the lady and the guy in the corner. And the lady starts taking off like her... Like her shoes, throwing them at it, like fake breasts, eyelashes, like wig, crap like this. It ends up being like a 35 year old man. The guy's like, uh, excuse me, what the fuck? And then it's like some. Switch to Geico. It's not a Geico commercial. <laughs> but it's like. Hey! It was like some gas station Get commercial lit. or something. I don't remember what the fuck it was. It was something stupid, though. It was really stupid. Hey. Get lit or I'll burn you. There's also that really racist uh, commercial. That's not really racist. I mean, it's pretty racist. But, like, this... It's another Japanese commercial. Remember that one KFC commercial? <sighs> Too easy. <laughs> <laughs> nah, do you... There was a freaking... Oh, hatchet. Let me finish this one first, okay? Um, okay, fine. But, like... The oh, no. Asian lady, like, there's this black guy, he walks into the room. Uh, uh, Asian lady beckons him closer. Uh. Oh, cool. Yeah. Uh, the Asian lady beckons him closer, and then she that throws him in the washer, and he comes, like, she puts a tablet in. And then he comes out like a, like a very pale Asian man. <laughs> After being blushed. Okay. So dumb. Anyway, continue. Uh, that... This crowbar really seems like it would be better as an item. An item, yeah. Like to keep with me. Instead of just not keeping anything at all. That's probably another reason God why this game's so bad. Well, it's just like I can't keep any weapons with me. Like nothing. What was that KFT commercial you were about to talk about? Uh. You remember where it was just that black guy dancing with two <laughs> fried chicken legs? <laughs> I forgot all about that. It was really great. Oh, man. He was so happy with that chicken, though. Ugh. He was so happy with you can, it. I think you could knock that fucking speaker off the table. I saw it, like, budge a little bit. For your information... What was that? Is that a mouse? No. Something rolled across the floor. That was your imagination. Uh, okay. Yeah. For, for information's hey. sake, though. We are not racist. We just... Find shit like that funny. It's not even... Well, it's kind of racist, but it was funny, though. <laughs> yeah. It's not like it's not funny. I... That's, what, like, something I have against fucking today is just, like, society. It's, like, everything's fucking... I wish fucking... white people had funny racist things. Yeah. <laughs> All we got is Cracker and stuff. It's Starbucks. But that's yeah. only for white women. Oh, key. Whatever you say, I go to Starbucks every day. If I had a Starbucks near me, I would. I don't really. Um. I love Starbucks. What? Oh, it's one of those CPR things. Okay. Have you never seen one of those before? Like, they're at, like, every fucking school. Okay. Like, in the cafeteria, like, if you look, like, on the walls and shit near the, uh, thing, you'll just see, like, this is how you do CPR, and I thought it was the most fascinating thing when I was a kid. Okay. Just going through school and just, like, oh, man, that's how you do CPR. I'm gonna throw something down my friend's throat to make him choke. Wow. Then someone actually needed CPR. Why can I not run here? What is up? I don't know. Uh, but then someone actually needed CPR uh, at my school because they had like they were like choking on some oh, shit. Oh, did you save them? No. I kind of oh, freaked out and ran to the teacher, and then the then he ended Whoops. up passing out. And then we had the, the ambulance got called and shit. Man. I was in third grade. You was. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs>
touch here. Oh, it's metal. <laughs> it don't work like that. Oh my god. Okay. I think we're gonna continue this next time. Uh, wait, what did I just get? Did I get a another crumple of paper? Check your inventory. Um. Uh. Check <laughs> your inventory. Hold on. Uh, I don't know. Wait, wait, did it say a small flip top lighter? Yeah. It's like a, it's basically a Zippo lighter. Just say Zippo. Or is that just a, no. a Zippo brand? It's a brand. Oh. What are those lighters normally called? Flip top lighters.